Volcano Bay. Some of the slides are getting put in place already. Look at that. We've got construction. Disney Quest. Parking garage. Hey everybody, it's Friday. We're at Disney Springs. The vlog starts now. The escalators don't work here either. Like at Planet Hollywood. Holy cow. They're ripping that thing to shreds. And we've got a lot of stuff done over here. So you can see where they're gonna have like, I guess, new bus entry lanes over there. And this is the world of Coca-Cola that's coming here. There should be a really cool meet and greet with a, a polar bear, if things are correct. And off in the distance, we've got the new water tower. So they're not replacing the Earful Tower from Hollywood Studios here. I know that that was rumored for a while, but they got their own tower. And somehow, isn't that what it's all about? Here's some concept art, what Coca-Cola is going to look like while it's done. I like that patio up top, reminds me a little bit of Amway Center. And this is what Planet Hollywood's going to look like. Most impressive. So once again, characters in flight closed due to high wind. You can see how windy it is out here. Or not. And I bring the ring. Do they still call these things sun showers? Every once in a while when you just pan the crowd, you find faces that you recognize. Oh, look at this guy. Because you know, D Street used to just be all about Vinylmation and they got rid of like all of the other Vinylmation stuff. Like they used to have a huge thing up on the ceiling with all the vinyl guys and everything. And now they took all of the guys off the conveyor belt and just replaced them all with Star Wars figures. So, just Star Wars vinyls. Look at this snow globe. Sometimes you feel light, sometimes you feel dark. Check this out, another talking Yoda. The copyrighted music is too strong in this place. By God, it's Barry's long lost brothers. Larry and Gary. This is the best shirt in this place because it has Bosk on it. Check out the bedazzled Star Wars hat. Yikes. This has undoubtedly got to be the hottest hat you could possibly wear in Orlando any month of the year. Let's go to the Islands of Adventure store. Weird that they have it at Disney. Oh, I see what they're doing here, right? 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 Right. Ant-Man. It's a postcard. Who needs virtual reality when you can have Hulk fists for your PlayStation? Oh, it harkens back to Pleasure Island days. Just a bar in the middle of nowhere. By the way, at Disney Quest, not sure if you guys have heard that they had like a stay of execution. They're not going anywhere, at least shortly. So they were supposed to close this year, but now TBD. You can go half price most nights because this stand is out here almost all the time. And now the bad thing is, like my annual pass doesn't include Disney Quest anymore, so I can't even go. Oh, Disney vans everywhere. Check it out, even Cheshire Cat on a hat. Or are these bucket hats with other characters. Or backpacks. Check it out, Stick. it's almost done. This is the steakhouse. A modern American steakhouse. There's Chris. Stick. So if you remember back a long time ago, we used to count down to New Year's Eve like every night, like right here. Should we do it in tribute? Nah, too much copyrighted music. It's the ganacherie chocolate chapé. The handles are spoons. Whoa, Star Wars chocolate bar is $16. I'm out for that. Chocolate pops. Sixteen different flavors here. Six in dark chocolate, six in little chocolate, and four in white chocolate covered in dark chocolate. We're gonna sample the chocolate chipotle pepper. Good afternoon, everyone. Hello. How you doing today? Good. How are you? Quite well. Amazing. <laughs> this is those Star Wars bars. Star Wars. Making chocolate. 
Chocolate bacon. <laughs> so they put the chocolate down, make a design, and then they put that like liquid nitrogen on it to freeze it. Stamp it. Pretty cool. We're going to hang a bar again. Dun 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 dun. Shut up. Dun dun dun. Dun dun dun. dun. Oh my god, they're doing like drinking games in here. They started without us. For those who have not watched one of our videos before, this place is a tribute to Indiana Jones. This is from his partner, Jock Lindsay. That guy. This is his hangar. The hangar bar. It was lost for years. Disney uncovered it, Disney Springs, and brought it back to its former glory. And here you have one of the best artifacts. It's the headpiece to the Staff of Ra. We've got a lot of other cool stuff. And they tie in Disney Springs here with like their little ice and water. I would do this, this is there. Up top in the corner. It's the fertility idol. Watch out for boulders. And heads up, they're no longer taking artifacts as payment. So we're sitting on the patio of Jock Lindsay's. Not a bad view. This is the drink that we ordered. You can order it in the glass and keep the dart, but they do not have the glass for you to keep. I don't know why. On the flip side, we came here to get this, and now they have the glass, but they don't have the stick. What the heck? So this place has literally been open for probably six to eight months at this point, but they still do not have half of the things that they're supposed to have on the menu. This is the drink. This is the dart. It's cool. It's got a koosh on it. Koosh! Let's see how it tastes. It's okay. No, it's really not that okay. And now we're gonna have our bagel pretzels. Woohoo! The sun is almost gone. It's pretty awesome. By the way, check out this radio. That's sick. Ah, it's a better picture of the fake Indy. Take a look at his face. And that should settle any question. I know some folks were asking whether it was actually Harrison Ford in the pictures. Definitely not. Free entertainment.
speed racer boat. Check it out. You can just sit here, order whatever you want, lounge around in these chairs, watch the sunset. For those wondering, these boats for the most part are not necessarily touching the water too. They are on rails just above the water. So we've been sitting on the patio of the boathouse for about 15-20 minutes. Not a single server has come over to take our order. I will say though, this dock patio, it is wavy as all well. 81 degrees. Look at that sky behind me. Lovely day. Lovely night. I got a Moscow Mule. Vodka, ginger beer, lime juice, and a copper mug. Volcano. So we didn't have food at the boathouse, but we had a drink. I just gotta tell you, the drink was good. Service, absolutely awful. Some of the worst service that I've had at any of the restaurants at Disney. Never ending flow of people, holy cow. So by the way, Fulton's Crab House is going to go under a long term refurbishment shortly. The amount of people is just staggering. Cause I'm a rocket man. A rocket man. I'll be Chris in action, taking pictures. Landscape. What is he up to? What f-stop are you using? It's amazing. Let's get a view behind. The genius that is Zombie Chris. That girl thought I was taking her purse because I bumped into her. Perhaps she shouldn't be swinging her purse around that much. Coming soon to this little shack, BB Wolf's Sausage Company. So in other words, the big bad wolf has caught the little pigs, has cooked them, and is now selling them at Disney Springs. Family entertainment. Fireworks going off in the distance. Or a nuclear bomb. This is the madness inside the Lego store. Soak it in. Yikes. Two awesome Star Wars characters that died before their time. Or did she? Creepy Snow White is creepy. Those islanders have homes. This store seems new to me. I don't know how long it's been here. Travel accessories? That's about the size of a seat these days. All kinds of cool luggage. Captain America. I like this one a lot. Like old school painted on it. By the way, this thing is $200. Spidey. Tons of Star Wars bags. It's pretty cool. These bags with this design are sometimes at the clearance center on iDrive. So Disney character warehouse. Oh, excuse me, sir. I didn't realize you were sitting here. That stewardess is kind of small. That bag seems awfully big for her. Airplane seats in the middle of the store. Yay. They still have plenty of these Disney Springs bottles. 
$12. I think they used to be $10. I have to go back to one of my old videos, but I think they increased the price. Skull Island for King Kong at Disney? What? I'm just kidding, by the way. I know that that's not that. I do like this a lot, Kungaloosh. Bring it back. Disney does not sell toy guns, but they still sell bows and arrows. Coming soon, it's the Aristo Creeps. Aristo Creeps. Aristo Creeps. So I thought about getting our characters in flight because the balloon's finally going up. But look at this line. Holy cow. Well, that's a wrap from downtown Disney. Disney Springs, if you will. Thank you for all of your likes. Thank you for your comments. Thank you for your subscriptions. Treat others the way you want to be treated. Have a great night. We'll see you guys. is still in my Yeti cup 16 hours later. Not getting paid for this, but just saying.